crazy images developing this morning. Heavy rain leading to flash flooding in Hanksville. A small Utah town of the intersection near Capitol Reef has been hit really hard. Fox 13 Scott McCain joins us live now. And Scott, the town has a long day of cleaning up to do. Uh, maybe several days, and uh, it's a situation of uh, rain, rain, go away down there in Hanksville and some other portions of southern Utah, uh, really taking the brunt of these most recent storms. But overall, it's been a really rough summer uh, for parts of central and southern Utah. You know, while most of the rest of the state is dealing with uh, severe to extreme drought, they have been getting more than their fair share of rain. It's led to flooding and other kinds of problems. And again, uh, some new video uh, supplied to Fox 13 News overnight shows uh, just an impressive amount of water. National Weather Service forecasters say that in some areas, it's up to six feet deep. And they've also issued multiple flash flood warnings. Now, currently, State Route 24 and 95, they're both closed. This is from Canesville to Hanksville along the Fremont River. Also from Hanksville south to Lake Powell along the Dirty Devil River. National Weather Service forecasters, again, they're asking everyone to avoid these areas. And also a simple rule of thumb, if you're driving around there and you have to be in that area, but you see standing water on the roads, flooded areas, turn around, don't drown. Now, we're expecting to hear some more about opportunities for folks uh, who wish to help out, either to contribute financially or with manpower to go down and help out. Uh, we're hoping to get some more information on that, and as soon as we get it, we'll be putting it on our website, fox13now.com. For now, we're live in Salt Lake City. Scott McCain, Fox 13 News, Utah.